are warming up. That's the good news. Most of us into about those lower 30s by 8 o'clock. Of course, the surrounding counties, you guys are definitely into about those upper 20s this morning, closer to 50 degrees by noon, starting to bring in some of those kind of higher clouds. Wind shift from the southwest, that warms us up to about 65 degrees. So definitely seeing those clouds increase as we head throughout the day ahead of that cold front moving through. So looking at that forecast where you live, there's those clouds increasing, but dry throughout the day. It's 65 for that high in Knoxville to Paragate to 68. Teleco Plain, 64 there. Kingston, 61 for that high today. Crossville to Oneida, 63 in La Follette. Your 62 Taswell to 64 for that high in Jellico. 65 for that high Dandridge to 64 Sneedville into Pigeon Forge. 64 for that high as well into Townsend. There's those winds picking up. They're pretty calm throughout the morning, but gusting up to about 20 to 25 miles per hour as we head into those afternoon hours, and that's really going to help warm us up. It's also ahead of that cold front, so expect those breezy conditions to continue throughout the night tonight. So we start out the sunshine today. Those clouds are slow to increase there even by noon there could be seeing those mostly sunny to partly cloudy skies definitely seeing that thicker cloud cover move in by the later afternoon to those evening hours and then we're tracking that rain to move in overnight mainly as we had early into your friday but could start to push into the plateau parts of southeastern kentucky there closer to about three four o'clock in the morning and then moving into our area six seven a.m it's going to continue throughout the morning hours, so you definitely want that rain gears are stepping out the door but closer to that eight o'clock time frame at least we're dealing with some of that lighter rain in and around the Knoxville area and then that's going to continue to kind of on and off throughout the day. Look at noon on Friday. Definitely want to pack the lunch as you don't want to be out and about in this gloomy and rainy weather. By the afternoon though, we're slowly starting to see some of those showers push out of here. Could could continue to see a few between that five, six o'clock time frame foothills towards the mountains. We're clearing out, drying out throughout the overnight hours and then could be dealing with a little bit of some spotty mountain snow there by the time we get early into your Saturday morning. As for how much rain, it's definitely gone down a whole lot, about a quarter of an inch, isolated half an inch into some spots, maybe isolated areas getting up to an inch of rain, but I think most of us are kind of right there at about half an inch by the time we get through your Friday. Those temperatures drop to 30 by Saturday morning. 48 to 43 this weekend, definitely a cold weekend ahead. Spring officially begins there on Monday. You'll see temperatures, though, slowly warming up throughout the week next week.